See, now, to me, that button's in the worst possible spot. The second button literally makes or breaks the... Oh, my dad watches this. I, I know this no TV show. Play. I've seen it before. <laughs> you do, of course, try on when you buy. Yes, it was purple. I liked it. I don't actually recall considering the button. Oh, you don't recall. <clears throat> no, uh, not at this time. <laughs> well, Senator, I'd just like to know what you knew and when you knew it. <laughs> Mr. Seinfeld, Mr. Costanza. Are you sure this is decaf? Where's the orange indicator? It's missing. I have to do it in my head. Decaf left, regular right. Decaf left, regular right. It's very challenging work. She needs to learn. That was a clip from the first ever episode of a TV show called Seinfeld. I don't really get it. Movie candy is an odd thing, too. Did you ever... Are those the normal sizes of candy that we see <laughs> elsewhere in the world? Because I don't even know. It's like really what my mom watches. But you look at it, is that like a lens, that glass case? Is that like a thick, is that like cataract glasses or something? Because it's just huge. I mean, I've never seen, that's the it's normal not that funny. That's, that's the size that it normally comes in. All right, I'll take it. You know, people are just rolling goobers like giant. The reason everything is so expensive is because it's, it's like two like times bigger. I mean, he's not wrong. Anyway, you know, just, Movie theater candy is just like. I need a bite of food for every frame of film. That's what I gotta have or I cannot enjoy the movie. Okay, same, same. So you agree? <laughs> On that one only. Once I saw like the background of the screen, I thought he was gonna Rick roll me. I would say I would watch this. He's <laughs> a cute little snuggly baby. Isn't he gorgeous? Really? <laughs> You're looking at a disgusting child. Oh, it's gorgeous. Yes. So very. Yeah, they don't like the baby. <laughs> Is it me or was that the ugliest baby? I want to see the baby, but then I don't want to see the baby. I just want to. Psh, show me the baby! It was like a Pekingese. Boy, a little too much chlorine in that gene pool. <laughs> And you know the thing is... Tell him he's ugly so he can put some makeup on. Oh, you have to lie. Oh, it's a must-lie situation. Yes, it's a must-lie situation. That is a lie situation. You can't tell someone's baby's ugly. If they were my best friend, I'd be like, yeah, your baby's cute. <laughs> when you're, like, about to die, you write them a letter saying your child was actually very ugly. Life situations with Robert. This guy makes the best soup in the city, Jerry. The best. You know what they call them? Soup Nazi. Shh. All right, then I'm, I'm not letting you Soup Nazi? On. Wow. Medium turkey chili. I love the sidewalk they have Medium to do where they're just like fish. stiff and just like. I didn't get any bread. Just forget it, let it go. <laughs> um, excuse me, uh, I think you forgot my bread. Bread, two dollars extra. Two dollars, but everyone in front of me got free bread. You want bread? Yes, please. Three dollars! <laughs> what? No soup for you! Snatch business! I'll probably be like Jerry and just be like, yeah, just go, go. Just a silent, don't ask for the bread. Rookie mistake, man. It's like stereotypical. And stereotypical stuff is not okay. Might have been okay back then. But now, no. At least he got his money back. You're not going to believe what's happening with Leslie. You know, since you agreed to wear the puffy shirt on the Today Show, she's getting all these orders from boutiques and department stores. Uh-huh. Since I what? What? Agreed to wear the puffy shirt. What are you talking about? What you puffy said shirt? You would agree to wear the puffy shirt on the Today Show. Um, now that's a big, oh, he's regretting his decisions. <laughs> OK, Jack Sparrow. Looks like a wedding dress and a, and a sweater combined together. I agreed to wear this? Yeah, yeah. Well, when did I do that? When we went to dinner the other night. What, are you crazy? On Tuesday the 19th, here in New York, I feel for the good terrible. A used clothing organization I feel that terrible provides for services it. to the needy. One of the performers will be comedian Jerry Seinfeld. Jerry, good morning. Thank you, Brian. And speaking of clothing, that is a very, very unusual shirt you have on. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. He looks like he was in England, but like 
thousand years ago. I would probably burn it. A hundred percent no. If you give me a corset to wear with it, I would wear it. <laughs> we should all know that at least. Ding, 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 ding. Good morning. All right, let's go. Hey, come on, let's go. <laughs> She said she'll do it. Not that there's anything wrong with that. It makes me wonder, were they having a conversation and then he was eavesdropping? He said, FBI, open up! It's a running gag and I love it. He needs to learn how to not, he needs to go back to preschool. I would just ask him to please stop because it's very annoying. Now, a friend of mine thought she got Legionnaire's disease in a hot tub. Really, what happened? Eh, yada, 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 just some bad egg salad. Yada, yada, yada. Say something. How is a bad salad involved with a hot tub? I'll be right back. Nice girl. Lovely. I noticed she's big on the phrase yada yada. Is yada yada bad? Oh, yada yada's good. She's very succinct. She is succinct. Yeah, it's like you're dating USA Today. It was probably smart at the time, but now it's just like, why do that? No, it's not good. What well, is a sink story? <laughs> I'm surprised you drive a Cadillac. Oh, it's uh, it's not mine. It's my mother's. Oh, are you close with your parents? Well, they gave birth to me, and better not say yada yada yada. Yada, yada what? Better. Yada yada yada. <laughs> How dare you? That seems so wrong. If any of my friends ever start doing that to me, I just slap them. <laughs> yada, 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 yada. All right, who's dancing? Come on, who's dancing? You want me to, want me to get it started? I'll get yeah. it started. Yeah. <laughs> you get electrocuted, honey? Show me how she dances. Moses. If I ever saw someone dancing like that, I would just leave. Or I would get more shots. It's like an old lady cracked her back. She needs a thousand percent dance lessons. So you know animatronics from FNAF? It looks like one of them is having a seizure. This is a must-lie situation. She wants to say hi. She's with her new boyfriend. What's he like? He's nice. Bit of a close talker. A what? You'll see. <laughs> This is Aaron. Hello, Aaron. Hello. Hello, Aaron. So how long are you folks in town? Oh. <laughs> Three more days. Three more days, and then we're off to Paris. Yeah. See, that's what happens to me at school. When somebody wants to talk to me, they do this. <laughs> it's their last year. In fact, you know, I still have an envelope full of French friends. Are you OK? The threatening, non-threatening way of just going, hey, man. How long you been in town? That's comedy, weird. Stay six feet away. Six feet, people, six feet. I know he's here somewhere. Ellen, have you seen my fiance? He's upstairs. Are you going upstairs? Tell my fiance I'm looking for him. <laughs> I have lost my fiance, the poor baby. <laughs> Go upstairs and look for him, though. <laughs> Maybe the dingo ate your baby. <laughs> The dingo ate your baby. What's a dingo? I don't know, can you tell me? It's an ancient type of dog found in Australia. Dogs are adorable, and I don't know why she's saying that, so that's kind of mean. Jail. 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 Your prison's right over there. Why would it be funny to adults? Since I'm a kid, I won't really know. From the clips I've seen, if those are the highlights, what are the bad points? Oh my god, he's in jail. See, now to me, that button is in the worst possible spot. Really? Oh, yeah. The second button. Oh, there she is. Okay. I said, she, she's in her prison right here. Look at it. It's too high. It's in no man's land. Haven't we had this conversation before? You think? I think we have. Yeah, maybe we have. Was that conversation in the very beginning? Because that was the first thing we watched. That man needs to get new shirts. 
Seinfeld won a lot of awards when it was on TV and it was incredibly popular. It was named one of the greatest TV shows of all time. Probably because they, at the time, they thought that was funny even though it's not funny at all. I don't really like it because, you know, it's like more for grown-ups. Zero won't be Seinfeld, but it would be like worst show ever. Seinfeld would be a, like 2.8. Back in the old days, a lot of things were popular that people don't understand now. Definitely pointless, uh, but amazingly pointless. Even if you don't genuinely get the joke, it's still, the way they say it still makes it funny. Would you watch Seinfeld? Yes, I would watch it. I've seen half the scenes, I'm good. I don't think so. No. I don't actually drink tea, so not my cup of soda. Thanks for watching Kids React. Subscribe to our channel or no soup for you. No soup for you. No soup for you. Bye. 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 I just ended it right there.